Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Assalamualaikum and very good day to you all. My name is Dr. Ahmad Mazi. I'm a lecturer from Malaysia. I have skill to do uh, research methodology and I have a uh, skill to find facts from uh, uh, from from many various journals. Uh, and now in this video research potential series, uh, I in this video. I make a video for microwave heating. Okay, potential research for microwave heating. You can see my other videos in the YouTube channel. Uh, you can subscribe in the YouTube channel. Okay, I have made. Uh, I'm trying to make uh, videos uh, relating to many subjects. Okay, for this video, I'm talking about microwave heating. Okay, so. This article is written to help potential students in doing research in microheating for this infection. Okay, students can use article this article content as guided to their research. In this article, a collection of journals taken from Science Direct. Myself had done analysis of the subject matter. Uh, myself had listed all the equipment method, finite element method, materials, and much more tools to help uh, you doing your research. Potential student can use the article to uh, discuss with your supervisor what you want to do. Okay. So, uh, research gap for desification is not many discussing about uh, microwave heating is uh, actually okay. What is a uh, microheating? Uh, in Design Direct, only 22-23 is result, and I have downloaded uh, all the extract related to it, and I have, I have analyzed. The extract content. This uh, the video I take uh, is from what I analyzed. Okay, actually, what is microwave heating? Okay, microwave heating is that uh, you have termites, you have insect in your in your food. Let's say uh, for the rice, uh, for the rice, for the seeds. Okay, these are. This is uh, the particles. These are all the particles in grain sand. Remember, we, we did a rice, we did a seeds, okay, with or anything. The insect, okay, the what you want to kill is is here. This is the insect, okay. This is the insect. Is located. Is positioned at the below one okay using the heat from the sun you may kill only on the surface okay only the insect on the surface you may kill but how about the insect inside the surface okay inside the uh, how many millimeter how many uh, centimeter imagine you are in a st uh, storage the big storage okay this big storage of the insect okay um, only on the upper surface you may kill the insect okay you may kill the termites and everything so what about the under surface okay the below one the bottom one okay cannot kill so this will affect the quality of your um, of your product okay so microwave heating is among the solution among the solution the problem about microwave heating is that uh, if you do it uh, uh, more uh, microwave on it maybe the seed the rice will damage you want to kill the insect suddenly you have to kill only the uh, the protein the the quality of the rice that you want to protect this is uh, among the problem the uh, challenges for the students okay so this uh, i analyzed from all those uh, all those papers and this is some of it okay uh, one of one of the lecturers do the conveyor system for multi age grain drying for super high frequency micro heating subsequent lying and converting cooling in fluid bed of dry material some of them use the biochemistry of soil to allow pollutant to persist, and then another one using the uh, non-uniform temperature distribution to create process material limits to wide application of uh, microwave treatment, 
and then another one use alternative method to improve efficiency for industrial application of meat moisture such potato this is what they have done okay now we're talking about the problem statement okay this is the problem that you may want to do okay it uh, maybe this problem is related to what you are uh, dealing with okay just take a note micro treatment does not kill all insects however the number of offspring decreased by 75 percent bribing insect of, of wheat could be alternative method for uh, insect desification okay so micro treatment is the problem you cannot kill the insect okay but you can kill the babies okay 75 percent so imaging uh, the technology mentioned here can be developed in early 21st century, 20th century, however, they are not related to any large scale, so, uh, such as scanning or heat pasteurization. Commercial heat sterilization uh, has been used in for decades to produce safe foods. However, however this technology can have potential uh, detrimental effect on this natural quality of foods. And then, for powder, appreciated uh are appreciated worldwide and enable foods to preserve or for a certain period without significant loss of quality okay however it's evident development of resistant microbial spore and available microbial cell is a matter of concern uh, this is among the problem that uh, those researchers have encountered okay. and these are the research objective that they they want to do maybe the fact i given here I, that I collected from the those journal is related to you. Maybe you want to do this kind of research, okay? Uh, want to test the new, new technology to reheating big foods, okay? Using radiation, okay? Evaluate the effect of temperature, Eva investigate temperature distribution impact bed of colonel seeds, uh, study the possible application of radio frequency RF energy for this impact may rise without affecting product quality. Uh, develop and reduce the cold spot area and re improve uh, radio frequency heating uniformity in high mid potato such this is among resources and this is what you should expect to happen uh, in your result meaning that uh, by analyzing all the extract from the those journal you may have some idea uh, the end product that from your research uh, some of it, some of the extract shows that uh, process effective to reheat sample, providing attractive sample to consumer. Regression method uh, established between microwave radiation. Okay, A artificial neural network methodology to processly predict experiment data with high correlation efficient. Okay, and uh, for the heating rate insect, uh, this result will be the heating rate of insect was 1.4 times greater than soybean. This related simulation demonstrate the price, uh, placing insect of cold spot is layer or horizontally and insect and large insect may cause less selective heating within the insect bodies. Okay, this is among the expect, uh, uh, expected result. Uh, I should mention that artificial neural network is the most uh, mentioned in those uh, journals. Uh, you may consider using artificial neural network uh, yourself. Okay. In doing this uh, kind of research okay. now we're talking about uh, the tools the equipment that people have used in this kind of research for your research you may use the same thing okay you may use the same thing or you may use the better thing that now i have listed all that that i have analyzed uh, from those journals okay they are using uh, artificial network uh, neural network methodology uh, transmission reflexive method, balis penal method, cold storage, continuous treatment method, electromagnetic wave test, uh, signal test, effluent test, experiment test, heating uniformity test, test insect. And then the experiment they use, you may use also experimental block uh, te temperature, experimental temperature of insect, uh, radio frequency experiment. Then the equation, equation for those who like to do equation and simulation. There are these uh, heat transfer equation optimizing uh, EWC parameter equation. And then this is the model, uh, artificial neural network. This is the famous, famous model. And this is the simulation that you, they use. You may use the same simulation also.
this is the properties that uh, you may want to do this property the electric property in anti inflammatory properties nutritional properties ogo leptic properties sensory properties sensory analysis for viscosity analysis and uh, many more okay the technique they are using the transmission reflection time te line technique thermal and non thermal technique and then the equipment they use radio frequency equipment burless vernal method hydrostatic pressure ultrasound microwave and radio frequency etc and all uh, those are all that i have listed and this is the list of extract there are many more and also for the equipment tools in the pre-symptomatology part there are many more uh, students serious students who want to do this kind of research you can download the uh, full document that I have written in Microsoft Word uh, in the link in this description uh, below this video. Uh, okay, I hope for the best. Uh, God willing, inshallah, you uh, you can do this research. Remember, doing master, doing PhD is not that easy, but it also not that hard. Uh, with proper method, okay, with proper method, you will know what you want to do, experiment to do with this video, it may help you some, okay? Some it may help you uh, because you will not miss any experiment, any method, any equipment, okay? Uh, I hope for the best, okay? So, see you in the next video uh, on another topic of uh, research potential. Thank you very much.